Welcome to Brightly Storytime. I'm Miss Linda. Today, we're going to read a story about a little shrew who gets into a lot of trouble. It's called Look Out, Leonard by Jesse James, illustrated by Tamara Anagon. This is the shrew family. There's Mr. Shrew, Mrs. Shrew, Sam, Stevie, Sasha, Sydney, and Leonard. Good day to you. Hello there. Hi. Hello. Hey. Howdy. Where's he going? Oh wait, there he is. Yo. Today is an exciting day for the Shrew family. It's moving day. They have got a long journey through the forest to their new home. So Mrs. Shrew has asked everybody to hold on to each other's tails so that they don't get lost. There they all are. Can you count them? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All here, says Mr. Shrew and off they go. But what's this? Leonard is holding on to the wrong tail. This tail is too thick and furry to be Sydney's. Look out, Leonard! Phew, that was a close one. And look, there's Leonard's family. He's not far behind. Maybe he can reach Sydney's tail. Oh no, that's not Sydney's tail. That tail belongs to a snippy, snappy crocodile. Look out, Leonard. Yikes, that was a lucky escape. But where is Leonard going now? Uh-oh, Leonard has grabbed onto the tail of a slithery snake. He doesn't look very friendly. Look out, Leonard. Oh dear. Leonard had better catch up with the rest of the Shrew family fast. There they are. They're greeting their feathery friend, Mr. Parrot, on their way past. Leonard is close behind them. What a relief. Oh no. That's Mr. Parrot's tail. Look out, Leonard. Plop. Boing. That was a big fall. Phew, what a surprisingly soft landing. Lucky Leonard. The rest of the Shrew family isn't far away. If Leonard is quick, he can reach them. There they are. Leonard is almost there. Come on, Leonard. You can do it. But what's this? Leonard's family has met a big, hungry, scary tiger. What are they going to do? Uh-oh, that tree branch is very wobbly. Leonard is very high up. Look out, Leonard. But look, Leonard has knocked off one of the coconuts right onto the tiger's head. Hurrah, clever Leonard. But how will Leonard get down from the top of that big, tall tree? Look out, Leonard. There he goes, sliding down that leaf. Wee! Well done, Leonard. That was an exciting adventure. But now little Leonard is back with his family and he never wants to get lost again. Who knew a little shrew could find such big trouble? I'm glad Leonard was able to help his family out in the end. 
come back again to read more stories together anytime you'd like or find more books to read yourself at readbrightly.com. Bye.